Hey guys, welcome out to the next stop. Welcome out to the beautiful Cumberland. And behind me, as you can see, we've got the beautiful boardwalk section of Nurragingi. It's just magic, mate. This place is just off chops. We've got heaps of frogs down here, like Perrin's tree frog, spotted marsh frog, striped marsh frog, eastern dwarf tree frog, um, eastern dwarf frog. They're just so many frogs down here, uh, green tree frog. So I'm going to go for a walk today. I don't know if we'll find any frogs because um, there hasn't been much rain lately, just a little bit. So let's get out on the walk and find out what we've got on the next stop on this magic Monday, eh? With the Cumberland Nature Crew in paradise, guys. Let's get out of here. See what we've got on the next stop. Uh, here we go, here's a different red belly. I don't know if I've seen this fella before. Making his way along the track there. Beautiful. A magnificent looking red belly. Yeah, definitely haven't seen this one. A bit smaller than the, than the usual one that I see here. Beautiful looking snake out on the Cumberland. Absolute bolt of this red belly. And as you see, he's not going to move much. So, um... Might do me old trick again, eh? And get in and um, film some on my phone and see how tolerant this bloke is of me. Seems alright, actually. Uh, just zoom back. See if I can get myself in the picture doing some filming of this mad red belly. I'll sneak in face to face with him and see what goes on there, eh? Okay, folks, let's get stuck into it. See if I can get some footage out of here, eh? Okay, guys, just taking some footage now. Mad red belly. Absolutely mad red belly. You can see me making my way around. Just getting some film on me. Oh, he is gorgeous, eh? How gorgeous is this guy? Oh, he's taking off. That's just magic, mate, on the Cumberland. The beautiful red belly black snake. Woo! And you know what? I hadn't seen this guy before either. He's a different one. Just awesome. Out on the Cumberland, mate. Oh, look at this little ripper, folks. Beautiful azure kingfisher out on the Cumberland. Magical colours on these guys. Beautiful, beautiful animal. One of my favourite animals out on the Cumberland and one of my favourite birds. Magic as you were Kingfisher. These guys are just spectacular, eh? The length of that beak just gets me. It's just incredibly long. For a bird that size, it's almost half its body length or more. He's just out there, he's hunting on the ponds. Be looking for some prey down in the water. Just mad this guy. Unbelievably beautiful. Is you a kingfisher? Magical. You a kingfisher out on the Cumberland. The colours of this beautiful, beautiful bird. And that beak, eh? Hey, how long is that beak? Just magic. He's out on the log, hunting for prey. Absolutely beautiful, this bird. Oh, remarkable. He's keeping his eye out for any prey on the water. They're a hunter and they hunt fish mostly. They're beautiful, these birds. The Azure Kingfisher. One of the most colourful blue birds that I've ever seen. You know, he's got his eye on something there. Yeah, just beautiful. So, it's been a, a week or two since I've filmed this um, beautiful Azure Kingfisher. So that's just magic. Really love these guys. They'd have to be one of my dead set favourite birds out on the Cumberland. And um, off he goes, down in the water. Flying right past me, actually. Awesome. Welcome to the log at Nurragingi on the Ginge. And um, looks like we might have a beautiful pied cormorant up here on the log. We'll just zoom in and give us a bit of a closer look and see what we've got on the log today. Definitely looks like a beautiful pied cormorant. Magic bird. Out doing a bit of hunting. Here's another fish hunter. So these guys are the fish hunters of the Cumberland, just like the magic as you were kingfishers out on the wetlands of the ponds, and just 
getting some sun, going to do some hunting, absolutely magnificent bird but love these pied cormorants and uh, he'll be have been diving in and catching heaps of little guppies and fish from underneath the water there. Magnificent bird these guys. Out on the Cumberland with a caveman on the Thursday. The beautiful log in Narragansett, an icon and a half. He's a ripper this guy isn't he? An absolute ripper. Bobby Dazzler and a half guys on the Cumberland. Let's zoom back and give you a look at the log in all of its world famous glory on the Ginge. Look at this cheeky looking fella. What are you doing up there mate? Yeah, you're a cheeky fella aren't you? Hey, hey guys, welcome out to the famous log in Narragansett. Yeah, on the Cumberland Plains. Just a beautiful little spot. Sun's out at the moment too, so that's just great. Uh, looks like a beautiful family of wood ducks out there on the on the log no reptiles today out on the log and as it cools down I suppose we've got to get used to that fact that um, there'll be a lot less reptiles around at this time of year and during the the winter period of course so beautiful wood ducks though out on the Cumberland out on the world famous log just a ripper mate Oh, how cool, little butcher bird, just on the side of the track. This beauty, magic butcher bird. Out on the Cumberland, the butcher bird, beautiful. On the side of the track there, having a bit of a look around. Mosey around for some food. Love a little skink or two on that track, I reckon this guy. Beautiful. Just up a bit further there. And look around, we've got a trap. See if we can catch him finding himself some food. Ooh, I don't know what he's doing there. Beautiful looking birds, these um This is the female, the the grey butcher bird. Beautiful animal. Ah here we have it. Lovely, lovely little butcher bird here. A, only a juvenile or a female. The beautiful, just um, doing a bit of feeding in the grass here. Very popular on the side of the track because you've got a bit of a clearing there, so I can spot their prey very easily out there. So they're beautiful, absolutely beautiful, grey butcher bird. Just up there on the edge of the track. On the next stop. They're a gorgeous bird, the butcher bird. Oh, he's flown straight at us. He certainly loves it down here on the track. The butcher bird finds all all kinds of things on the track up here. I reckon. And then beautiful grey butcher bird. Let's get out and see if we can find any animals out on the next stop in the sunshine in Narragansett, folks. So. Let's head off and see what we can find, eh guys? Next stop, there's few more iconic sites than this in the Aussie bush. The Kookaburra. He is an absolute bottler. Just up in the tree, he'll be searching out for some prey. And they are a predator and a half for a bird, these guys. That beak is just massive. Beautiful looking face on these guys. The eyes, just magnificent bird out on the Cumberland. So, second kingfisher for the day. Now, I wonder if we can get any footage of the uh, sacred kingfisher just to complete the three. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful laughing kookaburra out on the Cumberland. Really nice colours on these guys, that blue down the wings and that beautiful buff brown on the head. They're an absolutely beautiful bird. Put his eye on something down there. Okay guys, head off and see what we can find on the next stop, eh? Look at him, he's having a look too. Hey, did you hear me raise my voice a little bit, buddy? I'm not gonna hurt ya. Give us a little bit closer up, look at that beautiful face of yours. Oh, how gorgeous is that? Look at those eyes. 
beautiful eyes on those guys. Okay, we'll leave him be and we'll head out on the next stop on the Cumberland Express, guys. Captain Caveman Key. Beautiful kookaburra. Beautiful Aussie kookaburra out on the Cumberland. Just a magic bird. So here's a second kingfisher for the day. A bit bigger than the Azure kingfisher, that's for sure. Beautiful bird out on the Cumberland. The laughing, beautiful laughing kookaburra. It's got a pair of these beautiful kookaburra in the tree up here. They're an amazing bird. The second kingfisher for the day. And uh, the largest kingfisher is an absolute bottler. Beautiful, beautiful bird, the kookaburra. Iconic bush bird, the sound. And there's another one just up above him, you can see just there. And a couple of beauties just there. And, uh, I guess I'll to put one up above. Oh, beautiful kookaburra, out on the Cumberland. How awesome are these guys? The sound of the Aussie bush, the magic. One of our favourite grasslands birds, the beautiful Eastern Rosella. Look at those colours, especially on the back. Beautiful patterns on these guys. One of the most magnificent looking birds you would ever see. Magic Eastern Rosella. Oh, I love these guys. Definitely one of my favourite birds out on the Cumberland Plains in the parrot world. Them and the rainbow lorikeets, such a magnificent palette of colours, eh? Just berserk. So yeah, just out here and um, taking a bit of film out at Nurragingi on the next stop. And, um, thought I'd show you the beautiful eastern rosella of the Cumberland Plains. So yeah, just magnificent. Been a few nice birds on the on the show tonight. Been really good actually. And um, these are amongst my all-time favourites, as are the, um, the Azure Kingfisher that I got footage of not long ago. Another magnificent bird. But there's something sweet about these beautiful rosellas. Just magnificent. Now here we go on the next stop, folks. Beautiful. The magpie. Absolute staple out here on the Cumberland. And a beautiful, beautiful bird. I actually love watching these guys just fossicking around on the edge of the track, seeing what they can find. Get a hold of all sorts of different things on the side of the track here. Uh, always something to look at down Nurragenji. It's magic. And these guys are just tops. I absolutely love the magpie. Such a friendly bird. I never get swooped by these guys, even in breeding season. They, um, they get to know you these guys and they're a really beautiful bird. The nature, they're so friendly, they're almost like a pet, the wild magpies once you get to know them. So yeah, sort of follow him around a little bit on the Cumberland track and um, watch him fossick for some food out here. They're such a staple, they get overlooked a lot of the time, the magpie, but they are an absolutely beautiful bird. So next stop, might head off and see what else we can find. Okay guys, the next stop, an absolute bottler, beautiful red belly black snake. And he's been out here for a few days on this same section of the track, well, quite some time. Right, check this beautiful red belly black snake out, guys. The sheen off those mad scales, they're just a magnificent looking snake. And get a bit closer look up at this guy and his, and his beautiful face. Ah, absolutely beautiful these guys. A uh, very placid snake, the red belly too, you can see he's not threatened at all. Um, if they feel slightly threatened you'll see that they'll flick that tongue out um, quite um, rapidly to taste the air and um, uh, then they'll transfer that um, chemicals and, and what have you up into the brain through the, um, the Jacobson's organ. So yeah, if they're not flicking the tongue out really often um, they're not too concerned, but this guy seems to have like, having a look in the bush. He might be off to hunt, go down into that um, bushland and hunt for some frogs. 
I actually filmed this guy the other day hunting for some frogs in here. So it's just great seeing him making his way through the grass there. Beautiful snake, the red belly. Um, he's just down through the grass making his way. He'll go for a hunt soon. Probably got plenty of enough warmth into the body there. There's a um, big solid body on the fella too. So, yep, beautiful red belly on the Cumberland. With Koozie the Hey guys, I just spotted a beautiful red belly just down here in the grass. I can see him just making his way into the grass. Probably going to be doing some hunting for some frogs and other morsels. So let's get out and find out if we can do a bit of filming on the phone up a bit closer in the grass, eh guys? Beautiful red belly, woo! Folks, just making his way through the grass. Beautiful red belly black snake out on the Cumberland. Looks like he might be hunting for some frogs, so hopefully, he can get some footage of this. Be mad, folks. Making his way down this way. Now I can see him just down here through the grass. Mad red belly black snake on the Cumberland. With the caveman and the Cumberland nature crew, guys. Just wicked. Hey guys, how cool was that, eh? Beautiful walk along the boardwalk in Narragingi in this wetland section. If you get a chance, get out here. It is just superb, mate, this boardwalk section. A lot of frogs and different animals, and even see red belly black snakes, some beautiful lace monitors. It is just gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful eastern rosellas out here as well. So that was just magic. Um, hope you enjoyed the show today. An absolute cracker. A few different varieties of animals. Like we had a couple of kingfishers. Uh, we had the um, great butcher bird, the beautiful red belly black snake, and um, it's starting to quieten down a little bit because the sun, it hasn't got as much bite as it had in summer, but um, yeah, we'll just persevere on, and there's always something special out on the ginge, mate. So get out there, get on the ginge, and enjoy nature, folks, and wherever you are, get down to your local nature reserve and enjoy it conserve it and protect it guys because um, for the future generations of our country these iconic animals, plants and landscapes we've got to keep these for the future guys without these landscapes, iconic animals and these magnificent flora Australia, it just ain't Australia guys so see you tomorrow on the next stop and conserve and protect this nature guys 